lung transplant is a life-saving procedure for selected individuals with end-stage lung disease. The most common diagnoses are cystic fibrosis and pulmonary hypertension. And as one of the very few centers who does lung transplant in infants, these babies can come with prematurity, from surfactant deficiencies, filamine A, among other reasons. Some of them are uh, children with um, unknown diseases, but uh, the doctors know they're getting worse. And the biggest group are older patients, particularly those with cystic fibrosis, whose families and themselves have watched their condition slowly worsen over time. The lung transplant program at Texas Children's Hospital is one of the largest programs in the U.S., completing more transplants in the past five years than any other pediatric program. This year, one of the program's founders, Dr. George Mallory, is passing the torch of medical leadership to Dr. Tina Melikoff, who will lead the program in partnership with surgical director, Dr. Jeffrey Heinley. We all share Texas Children's vision of taking care uh, of children with complex lung diseases. Each one of us is really involved with the areas of expertise from nutrition, from pharmacy, how to deal with psychological needs and psychosocial issues with families. One of the things I'm most proud of that we've achieved is a fabulous multidisciplinary team. And that's very common language in, in modern medicine, but we really have a great team. You need a center that has these resources and is able to do it, um, especially trained not only surgeons, but um, pulmonary medicine service, immunology service, which helps us with the immunosuppression, infectious disease, social work. I want to improve outcomes. I want to delay chronic rejection as long as possible, keep those kids with their family together. And I think the best way to approach that is through research, both clinical and basic. Because we're in Houston, in the central part of the country, we can get to both coasts. We can get the majority of the United States to do these procurements. We send a team from this hospital out to get the lungs. At the same time, we send a team to the OR with the trial to get them ready. And those operations are going on simultaneously. There are unique cases in the rest of the world and the rest of the U.S. For us, these are common cases. Moving into the future, the lung transplant program will continue to build upon the incredible legacy of Dr. Mallory's compassion and clinical excellence. Easily, the single best thing is to have engaged honestly and deeply with patients and families and see the majority of them um, uh, capture years of quality of life. It's much more than a dry scientific pursuit. It's a, an amazing opportunity to see miracles happen.